What is happening, y'all? Welcome. I'm back. Let's go take down some scars, shall we? Wait, can I command the dog? Yes. There's enough stuff here to make a pie bomb. Is there really? We got this. Bounces on impact and explodes after a short explodes explodes after a short delay. So am I supposed to roll this bitch along the ground? Have it go like boom, 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 and then blow up and kill a bunch of baddies? Coming in here like this is freaking MLB 2K20, knocking the shit out of that infected. I'm just looking for supplies. Calm down. Look up there. Could be a way out. I'll climb up there and check it out. Why do I not? I guess I don't go that way. Something there. Okay, I thought I saw loots. Um, that. All right, increased health, clarity, hold breath, steady aim, listen range, max health. Um. I mean, one health increase probably is worth it. I don't know about everything else. I don't. I don't think I need listen mode clarity or hold breath or range or like I would like this. I'm not gonna go through everything else to get to that. Guys! 
You can't, can't just go up and hit them. I don't know what part of the neck it's ripping out, a tendon or something, but whew. out of here. Mm -mm -mm. So this was like a, uh, a Home Depot or something? You'd think I would be like scrounging up parts on all these dryers and whatnot. I guess we're good. Let's go. Manny. 
things first. Another month and I wouldn't fit through here. Yep, well, I gotta change that fucking I coil. First. <laughs> I like yours. So we got the little Home Depot orange cart. Mm -hmm. Abby, this reminds me of your dad's greenhouse. Shouldn't. All these plants are alive. <laughs> good point. You know what? This is good. You two needed a bonding moment. Shut up, Manny. Actually, had to go by. <clears throat> had to run out today to pick up stuff at Home Depot. Doing some, uh, basically like filling in a slope in the backyard. And they had a pallet that was like 50% off. It was just topsoil. Basically, under the deck, there was like a recess. And so when it would rain, water would get up against the house. And so I was just filling that up, resloping the backyard so that the rain would route out towards the fence instead. Man, I got six bags of topsoil. For like four fifty, which I mean, it's, I know topsoil isn't exciting, but that's a good deal, because usually you're spending about you know buck fifty to sometimes three dollars. This was like the discount rack, so I just loaded up six bags and she came up and I was like, oh, this is the fifty percent off rack, and she was like, huh? I just pointed at the sign and she's like, oh, four ninety five. I'm like, great. Filled in the whole area, backyard looks great. All for less than five bucks. Home repairs on a budget. Fertilizer. So where are we going exactly? I know I know we're leaving, but I thought Manny was like going towards the exit. I've just been Busy telling the stories and picking up supplies. Right, so that's where I came in. So, I need to go I'm not getting out that way. I feel like this is a climbing puzzle I'm not seeing, or I'm going to have to like climb up and shimmy my way across something. Yeah, that's the only thing I can think that would make sense here. But where do we... Do you see a way out? I actually pressed the button for hint and it did absolutely nothing. This is like the. Oh, god damn it! I'm on top of the car. Bob said ahead. No scars in sight. Well, they're out there. Yeah. Let's keep moving. I think it takes something away playing her story after, because like we already know that Ellie kills like, you know, most of her friends. Could pass through this area without getting jumped by scars. Getting nostalgic about the truce? It's easier days, huh? Too easy. We let our guard down, and they strung up an entire squad. That was in retaliation to us shooting those kids. Okay, but those kids attacked our guys. What would you do? I don't know, not riddle them with bullets? I'd rather save our people. Many of their kids. It's not their fault. Not our fault either. Those deaths are on them. Okay. Not to jinx us, but it is very quiet out here. Keep checking those sight lines. Well, this seems like the place to go. Yeah, okay. I guess I just didn't get close enough to the door to 
Just show the button. Shit. Something's blocking the door. Maybe there's another way in. Up here. Oh shit. Manny, see what's up there. On it. something there you go come on up Mel stay with Alice I'll try to get that door open find you to another way in cool be careful well still no sign of scars Maybe they gave up? Oh. Long way down. Yeah, yeah, it is. Oh. <laughs> well, that is, uh, that is not what I meant to do. Also, I, I modified the mic slightly. I noticed that the uh, that I was getting a a little bit of uh, pickup from the, the new fan I got installed. So, okay, Mel. I increased in. my uh, suppression sure. filter by about ten decibels. I think that's gonna help, but um, I'll I'll have a better idea after listening to this video. I mean, honestly, as long as it's not cutting me off, that's all I really care about. Okay, come on. Quick. Yeah, sure. We're here. Well, I'm full on scissors. Whoa. Check it out. Some kind of boat workshop. Let's remember this place. Like right there, I just saw the mic pop a bunch from it. So what are we? We did we're 17 minutes in. I'll go back and I'll listen to it. So basically, I'm just gonna keep tweaking these filters. What's weird is it, you know, the fan. It's not a consistent. It's like every now and then, like a big burst of air will come down and hit the mic. And if I turn it upward like that, the pop filter might block a little bit more of it. Either way, I'll fine tune it, but. Know. If it's one of those things I gotta live with, if it means I can record without being sweaty as hell, I will take it. There's nothing is worse than being sweaty. I mean, usually, usually I don't get sweaty recording, but live streams, man, I get so sweaty on streams. Just between, you know, the three monitors, the computer, the consoles, the, the backlight, like, it's a lot of heat being generated. And the fact that you're, you know, packed into this, this one single room. It's very easy to just get sweaty. <laughs> sweaty is not fun. Um, burst fire. I mean, do I really need three round burst? I feel like I would just burn through my ammo with that. Let's do that. We'll do stability and then uh, I'm thinking a scope if I still have materials for it. Wait, shit, that is quick. I might, I'm pretty close. Let me, let me look around. I'm only 11 short of adding the four times. And usually right around workbenches, there's like a, yeah, like right here. There's always a cluster of parts near workbenches. And stability and scope means headshots for days. I think we're going to be fighting a lot of scars, so that's the... I think that's the right move. Three round burst sounds nice, but it would probably result in me burning through my ammunition. 
It's in Call of Duty. It's looking good. And then next we'll go capacity. Well, I can't afford it right now anyway, but 60. Another saw so another little burst of wind. Twenty one, that twenty one ten, roughly. Okay. I'll hold it here. Go. I'll bridge it with something. Ah! Ah! Sorry. You do okay? Yeah. Crank broke. What now? Abby, look. A hatch. Manny, just hang tight. We're gonna find a way up to the roof. So I think hey. turning the mic, turning the pop filter so, up messed it up more. Right. Remind me to thank Manny for that one. I am glad I'm here with you guys. I hate to hear you got in trouble and I couldn't help. Hey, why have you been avoiding me? I wasn't avoiding you. Come on, you've barely said anything to me since Jackson. I don't know. I, I guess I was shook by Jackson, too. You don't think Joel deserved what he got? I think he deserved worse. I just... I just wish I didn't take part in it. I get it. What kind of a person could do that, right? I'm not saying that. Let's see if there's a way to the hatch. All right. Hey, Abby, boost me up there. Got an idea. And boost you? I like ideas. Okay, here we go. Got it. Whoa, come on. No, no, she is not scampering up that shit with a pregnant so belly. Idea? Um, one sec. Are you fucking shitting me? Doing? Getting us out of here? Okay, just go slow. One advantage of being pregnant, low center of gravity. I'll take your word for it. No, no, come on, dude. Oh, made it. Oh, she's she's unlocking that door. Thank you. As someone with a pregnant wife at this very moment, I can tell you that that let me just climb over this. There's no fucking okay. way. I'm closer to the hatch. That would have happened. Just no, nope, 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 nope. The mushroom zombies are more believable than the pregnant girl scampering up a ledge. Reminds me a little of Owen's boat. Is he still trying to fix that thing up? <laughs> yeah. But he says he'll be done any day now. Any day now. <laughs> Everybody's got their obsession. Now with me and dog toys. Yup. And me with my stupid coins. <laughs> There's a catwalk running to the hatch. 
How do we get to the catwalk? Okay, that's promising. Okay, um, well, the rope's there, but, oh, hang on. There we go. Long way down. Afraid to go hitting you hard? Especially when I look down. There they are. Manny! Be right down. Okay. Look, Bob, sweet Bob. Almost there. Bet we can cut through that rail yard. You want to get off the roof first? <laughs> Please. It's kind of hard to imagine you being afraid of anything. I'm not as fearless as you think. Oh, please. Like, I, I could never do the surgery stuff you do. I'd be too freaked out about fucking it up. Oh, you think I don't feel the same way? Well, for what it's worth, my dad always said you were his best student. He did? Oh. He always said he was an idiot. <laughs> Come on. Alice. Oh, good girl. About time you two caught up. It's like me. Been quiet out here? Yeah. I don't like it. Oh, we're almost at the pub. Man, when we get back home... Okay, I thought there was a little wrap around. the couch, watch the movie... <laughs> And drink until they pass out. All right. Well, we made it through the whole warehouse and our initial rundown with the scars. So let's wrap things up here. Uh, but we will continue this on in a little bit. So stay tuned. Catch you all then.